Storage on the IQ 1, 2 and 3 is pretty simple to understand. All these backs take a CF card which can be inserted by opening the small door on the side of the digital back and inserting here. Be careful to make sure you're adding this the right way around and never force a card into the slot. We would always recommend good quality cards from known brands and 118 megabytes per second or faster or UDMA7. Always format the card in the back before use. You can do this from menu, format card. The other option you have is tethering to the computer. On the IQ 1, 2 and 3, you must make a choice of either tethered capture or capturing to card as the back cannot do both. You can tether through USB on the side or Firewire on the back. Both have advantages and disadvantages. USB is now the most common, however you cannot charge through this solution. You can also use Firewire. However, finding a native port on newer machines can be difficult and adapters can sometimes cause issues. If you wish to read more about this, you can find more information on the knowledge base.